What's up, y'all? Welcome to Random Reviews. I'm your host, Random. How y'all doing today? Today we have an e-liquid review for you. Today we have Killer Custard Lemon. Killer Custard Lemon. Okay. They taste it. They have been a pretty good company to me. I like their juice to you. Nah. It's your opinion. This is mine. So, their Killer Custard line has been really good to me. I'm a fan of Killer Custard. There was a custard that I tried when I first started vaping. It was by The Last Stand. Um, it was called Mechanic. It was a strawberry custard and it was just the shit. I loved it. It was my favorite custard blend. Unfortunately, they were in PA, part of this bullshit 40% tax. Put them under, put a hurting on them. They're no longer. Okay, that said, Killer Custard was one of the first ones to fill that void of one of my favorite juices. Um, and it was the first Killer Custard that came out that was, you know, I said, oh, I'm going to try this. Maybe this will fill up my uh, my niche for, you know, the custard. And for sure, it did. It didn't freaking disappoint at all. Moving on, Strawberry came out. It was great too. In my opinion, both really strong custard flavors. Now, the lemon. Now, I haven't had too many lemon custards that I've liked, so hopefully the Killer Custard brand will stand up to this. Um, so, that said, we're going to get right into what it's about here. So, I do Six Nick as always for you guys. I figure Six Nick is the strongest that they most companies make it in. So if it's bad in six, it's probably going to be bad in three. It's probably going to be bad in zero. So on and so on. So that said, we're going to get into it. Get it on premiumvapesupply.com. I'll leave a link in the description for it. It is $19.95 a bottle. It comes in zero, three, and six Nick. It's available most readily anywhere. If your vape shop isn't carrying Killer Custard or any Vapetasia products, it's probably not worth going to because, well, the brand speaks for itself. They're a very popular brand. Okay, so, that said, we're going to get right into this. We're going to crack this bottle open. We are going to smell it real quick, see what's up with that. I, do I really need to do a description with this? I mean, come on, it's, it's Killer Custard, it's lemon. Okay, so out of the bottle, I definitely get the lemons, very light, it's supposed to be, same thing with the strawberry one, it's very light, uh, get, definitely get that full flavored killer custard smell out of it, okay, now today, we're going to be using the Pro Color, again on my wife's, with the Troll 25 on top of it. These Clapton's Fresh Cotton Bacon V2. As always, we're going to juice this up. Get a quick whiff of it. On fire. How I do all my videos. Smell test, fire test. All that good stuff. Oh yeah. Man, this stuff smells so good. Okay, so I'm going in at 100 watts on the Pro Color. Okay, so as expected, definitely Killer Custard is there. I mean, it's just, it smells just like the original, with the exception that it has lemons in it. The lemon is very, very light, might I add. It's not very strong. I figured maybe with this lemon it was going to be strong, it was going to be pungent, it was going to be the most powerful smell out of it. That is not the case. Killer Custard Victasia so far. You guys are getting an A plus on this. Now, as we all know, smells can bug you out. Smells can just make you think something's going to be great and then you get it in your lungs and get it in your taste buds. And it tastes like other shit. So, I'm going to put the top on the troll here. We're going to take a couple quick chucks of this and I'm going to let y'all know what I think of this. Blowing at you guys. You can see it's really foggy. As with all they taste the blends.
Okay, first off, no itchy, no scratchy, no hoarseness, as per usual with Base Hazer. Okay, now, inhale, definitely get the clusters, definitely get a light, fluffy lemon. It's very light, but it's there. It's definitely what it is. On the exhale, it's more of the same. Lemon comes out a little stronger on the back end, which is cool with me because to me it, it could have been just a little bit stronger, but it is definitely approved here. It is definitely, definitely what it is supposed to be. It's a simple custard with a simple lemon in it. It was very easy. Um, no quarrels with it at all. It is definitely a good juice. I definitely recommend it to y'all. If you like the Killer Custard brand and you baked all the other flavors of it, you will definitely love the lemon. Even if it's not your taste, just give it a try, man. It's really good juice. Very pleasant to the palate. So with that said, like, comment, share, and subscribe. And I'll see y'all in the next video. Y'all have a blessed day.